Hi students, this is Ms. Whitaker and it is Sunday afternoon of spring break and I'm getting my lesson ready for tomorrow and our lesson today is how well do you know exponents? I'm going to keep this five minutes or less. I'm going to set my timer right now to make sure I keep it five minutes or less. Um, here we go. All right, so how well do we know exponents? Let's talk about the parts of the exponents to, to kind of refresh ourselves. So if I wrote this exponent, um, if I wrote 5 to the third power, let's talk about these parts, okay? They Each number has a, a name or what it's called. So if I look at this 5 right here, the big 5, this is actually called the base. You need to know that. And then the base is being multiplied by itself by this little number here. And this little number, 3, is called the exponent. That tells you how many times to write the base. The whole entire thing, this whole thing, the base with the exponent, the whole thing is called a whoops, power, a power. You need to know that. So we have the base, which is the big number that we're, that we're multiplying, repeated multiplication. The little number beside it is called the exponent, and the whole thing is called the power. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about how we do this. So if I have 5 to the third power, we are writing the base repeatedly by the exponent. So it would be 5 times 5 times 5. It is not, and let me say this again, it is not 5 times 3. Because 5 times 3 would equal 5 plus 5 plus 5. It is repeated addition. So multiplication is repeated addition. And exponents or powers are repeated multiplication. Okay, this is repeated addition, okay? So hopefully that will help you. So if I was really working it out, it'd be 5 times 5, which is 25, and 25 times 5, I think it's 225. Oops, nope, it's 125. 125. So it's going to be a much larger number than just 15. So this is equal to 125, okay? Um, what if I give you this and I write 6 times 6 times 6 times 6 times 6? And I ask you to write this in exponential notation. That means they want to see it as a power. So you got to look at first the number that they're repeating, which is 6. And remember, that number they're repeating becomes your base, that big number. The exponent which goes right here beside on that little number, is how many times they're repeating multiplying, which would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it would be 6 to the fifth power. And remember, the whole thing is called a power. This is called the base again. This is called the exponent. And the whole thing is called a power. Um... Remember again, this is not, this right here is not 6 times 5. Definitely not that. Because remember, that would be repeated addition. And I do not see addition, I see multiplication. Also, for your quiz to know, your quiz today, your Google Form quiz that you're supposed to take after you practice, after you're watching this video, they may show like a star in between, which can also mean multiplication. Okay, so I told you that I would keep my video short and sweet, and if you need to watch it again, you can watch it again. I miss you guys terribly. I hope you guys answered my question today about what you had or what you did during spring break. Um, and I look forward to, to getting your comments and, and seeing how you do in your Google Form quiz. Have a good afternoon. Bye-bye.